Good morning, this is Luke Thomas, Holmquist here at the Earthquake Forecast Center, quakeprediction.com. It is 8.48 in the morning on Friday, December 24th. Uh, Merry Christmas, happy holidays to everybody. Friday, December 24th, 8.48 in the morning, 2021. And we have a forecast and a warning for uh, California. <clears throat> Let's look at that. And here it is. Here's the latest uh, forecast map from this morning. The risk continues to build. It hasn't reached a peak yet here in uh, California. Right now, if you look, we have got a new graph out here, which uh, portrays what the magnitude should be. This quake on the uh, 7th of December should have been a 5.4, but it was a 5.8. This one here should have been a 6.2 on the 19th. It was a 6.2. And this, uh, right now, the risk level is at about a 5.4. 5.4 right now on the 27th, 5.0, about a 5.0 on the 26th. But the risk continues to build. And um, I'm seeing in some other forecast models, the, uh, the risk is going to be much, much higher than even this quake back here on the 19th. So we have to wait for this to, the, the energy to peak. Right now it's at about a 5.4, so we're going for a 5.4 to 7.5 is likely in California, December 25th through the 27th. <clears throat> and here's the most likely area right now. However, I think that will shift to the San Francisco Bay Area. Uh, right now it is in the area from Eureka to San Francisco Bay, kind of centered in the Ukiah area of Northwest California from Eureka to San Francisco Bay. So that's where the risk is right now. However, I think when this energy finally peaks here uh, on the 28th, I think it'll peak um, the risk level. Uh, that risk should be in San Francisco Bay. We'll have to wait and see. For right now though, uh, there's a warning for 5.4, as you see on the risk level here, 5.4 to 7.5 is likely in California, December 25th through the 27th. Most likely right now in the area from Eureka to San Francisco Bay. And we'll have another update tomorrow on this, um, but we need to wait for this to reach a maximum peak before we know exactly where it's going to hit. However, in the meantime, we could have some uh, foreshocks, 5.0, 5.2, 5.4 in this area here in Northwest California to San Francisco Bay. And we're getting some foreshocks up there right now. These are actually aftershocks here, 3.4, 3.6, 3.2. We've got a 4.9 down in the Gulf of California. That energy is spilling over into other spots. And uh, let's take a look at the Alaska forecast. Still a risk of a 6.0 earthquake, even though we got that 5.9 southwest of Anchorage. Uh, the risk remains high in Anchorage for a possible 6.0 today through the 26th of December. In Japan, the risk level is in the Tokyo, Ibaraki, Fukushima, Sendai area, Chiba, centered right now in the Ibaraki area. And that's the risk of the 25th through the 26th. They're ahead of us by about 14 hours. So it's already in the 25th of December over there. So on this map here. Then on the 26th, the 27th, the area, the risk remains in that same general area, except for closer to Chiba, Yokohama and Tokyo area. However, uh, we're going to put a graph on each of these uh, forecasts so that you understand uh, how much energy there is in this area. Right now, uh, this risk level in Japan is for about a 4.5 to 5.0, but we'll put a graph up uh, hopefully tomorrow or the next day so we can understand how much, how high the risk level is in that area. All right, and then on in, in Greece, we have this uh, risk area we told you about yesterday in Southern uh, Albania and Western Greece. And that's where the quakes have been hitting, uh, exactly as we forecasted, right there in Western Greece, a 4.4, 4.4, and a 4.3, right there in our warning area. So this forecast model is working really well. And uh, we will be adding, like I said before, we'll be adding a graph 
a risk level graph. This shows the magnitude of the earthquake on the left-hand column here. Uh, the date is on the bottom here. And we'll be adding this kind of a graph to uh, the Alaska forecast, Japan and Greece. Eventually be, uh, we'll be adding Italy, some other countries, but we're gonna stick with those four areas right now, California, Alaska, Japan, and Greece. And once again, in California, <clears throat> the risk is not reached a peak. I thought it was going to reach a peak here, but it, uh, it hasn't reached a peak yet. And as soon as this goes down, we'll know that we're, um, that's about the size of the quake we're going to get. Right now, it's still rising. The risk is still rising. It, it's at about 5.4 right now. You can see that over here in the left-hand column. It's about a 5.4. However, the 5.4 that hit on December 7th was a, turned out to be a 5.8. The risk level was at 5.4, was a 5.8. So um, 5.4 to 7.5 earthquake is likely in California December 25th through the 27th as of right now. And we'll see what happens tomorrow morning. When we get the new data, uh, we'll be able to give you a better idea. For right now, it looks like in Northwest California from Eureka to San Francisco. However, I think tomorrow's forecast, the risk will be in the San Francisco Bay. So please stay tuned. I think the risk is gonna go up even higher than the current 5.4. And I think it'll be up in the 6.5 to 7.5 range uh, in tomorrow's forecast. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. And please stay tuned. We are uh, gonna keep a close eye on this. And uh, for now, we can't, uh, can't tell you anything we don't know. So right now we know that the risk is continuing to rise. It's at a level of 5.4 right now. And the risk is centered in the Northwest, just Northwest of San Francisco Bay. However, tomorrow, I think that'll change. Please stay tuned. Tomorrow, we'll give you an update on this uh, forecast and uh, earthquake warning in California. Please stay safe and uh, be prepared for a, a major earthquake. I believe uh, the 20, now it looks like the 27th or the 28th. It could hit a lot, it could hit today, but. Right now, the energy looks like it's building up for the 27th or 28th of December. So we got to take it one day at a time. As soon as that risk peaks, we know uh, that we can then forecast the day and the location and the timing and so on. So uh, please stay safe, be prepared there in California, and we will give you an update again tomorrow morning. Uh, thank you to the 187,000 followers on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. 187,000 and 17 years of research now since 2000, uh, 2005. And uh, we're going into our 17th year of research and uh, keeping you informed about earthquakes. And eventually we'll be adding other earthquake uh, areas around the world. Chile will be adding that, Peru, Ecuador, and Nicaragua, El Salvador, and, and other areas as well. But for now, we'll stick with California Alaska, Japan, and Greece for now. Earthquake warning for California. Please stay safe in that area and be prepared. We're going to have a big quake in California. And right now the data shows about the 27th or 28th of December, but it could come uh, sooner. Please be ready. Thanks.